Hi and welcome. In this video, we'll walk you through how to create a complete lead magnet funnel step by step. By the end of this tutorial, you'll have a solid understanding of how to create a fully functional lead collection funnel while also getting familiar with the Click Funnels 2.0 editor. Right now, I have Russell Brunson's Funnel Hackers Cookbook PDF open in front of me, and you can see the diagram of a lead magnet funnel here. This is a free PDF, but this is a must read ebook. You will find the download link for the PDF in the video description. Let's start with a brief discussion about lead magnet funnels. A lead magnet funnel is a simple process to collect people's contact information, like email, name, phone, in exchange for a free offer, like an ebook or checklist. It has two pages, a squeeze page that explains what your free offer is all about, and a thank you page that provides the link to the lead magnet. The lead magnet funnel is also known as an opt-in funnel. Let's get started with creating a lead magnet funnel step by step. First, let's head over to the Click Funnels 2.0 dashboard. Click on the Funnels tab, then click Create Funnel. If we want, we can click on the Start from Scratch button to build from the scratch, or choose from an existing proven funnel type. Since we are creating a lead magnet funnel, I'm selecting the lead funnel type. Here, if you scroll down a bit, you can see many beautiful pre-built templates. By clicking the Preview Template button on any of them, you can see a preview of the design. If you like a template, you can click the Select Funnel button, and the funnel will be ready with that template. This will save both time and effort, but since our goal is to start from scratch, we will click on the Start from Scratch button. You have to enter a name and URL path for the funnel and click the Create Funnel button. However, you can update this information at any time later. Click on the plus icon to create an opt-in page as the first step of the lead magnet funnel. Now click on the page. There are various pre-made designs according to different categories and page types. You can start with these if you want. However, we will select the opt-in type and click on New Page. We will enter the page or step name, description, page URL, style guide, and whether it will be indexed by search engines as needed, and then click the Create Page button. This information can be changed later, so if desired, you can proceed to the next step by just providing the page name, this is required. Click on the Edit button to open the page editor. Now we will click on Add New Section to take a blank section. Then we will take a one column row. Within this, we will add headline text. Now we will take a two column row. In one of them, we'll add an image or video. In the other, we'll add a subheadline and a paragraph. After that, we'll add an input field and a button. Here we are just seeing how to design. You can change style-related settings for each element by going into its settings. If you want, you can add another section or row to create the footer. I am doing these quickly to save time. The editor in ClickFunnels 2.0 is an amazing drag-and-drop page builder. After creating a few funnels, you'll become much faster at it then it won't take much time to design a funnel page. After finishing all the work, don't forget to click the Save button to save your changes. We have finished working on our opt-in page. Now we need to go back to all steps to create the next page. Here we need to take a new step using the same process. The only difference this time is that we will select the page type as Thank You. Since you already understand how to design or edit a page, I will now choose any pre-made template. To change the template design and copy, you need to click on the Edit button. 
To see how our created page will look on a mobile device, click on the mobile icon above. You can also customize the mobile view separately if you want. Clicking on the I button will preview our page in a new tab. Our funnel design work is complete. Now according to the funnel structure, submitting an email on the opt-in page will lead you to the thank you or download page. Let's test the funnel to see how it works. For testing, I'm previewing the opt-in page in a new tab. Enter email address in the input field and click the Submit button. Wow, we've successfully navigated from the opt-in page to the thank you page. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Share this with anyone who might find it useful and leave a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. See you soon.